Hey guys, it's TT, and I'm here with Goldie and Bloxy in Bloxburg in this cute little shopping plaza. Hey guys, say hi baby sister. And we're so excited to do some shopping today. Uh, TT, can I put her on the stroller please? Yes, Goldie. A lot of you guys have asked me how Goldie and Bloxy are doing, and they're doing amazing. I know some of you worry that Goldie will be jealous, but she is such a good helper and it's such a great big sister, you guys. I am so proud of her. They're getting along just the greatest. But Goldie, just be careful with the stroller in the parking lot, okay? Okay, Mama. I'm gonna go real slow, really slowly, really slow. Okay, so this little shopping mall has a Claire's, a Bath and Body Works. Whoa, Goldie, you calm down. That is way too fast. Oh, but baby Boxy really likes it. She likes adventure. Okay, well, we don't want her throwing up her milk. Anyway, the plaza is still under construction. They have a Justice, a little Christmas um, store. Goldie, easy, okay? Okay, we're done. Titi, don't worry. Little Bloxy likes adventure. I told you. Look at her face. She's real happy. Mom. Okay, if you say so. Mm. So what store do you guys want to go in first? You know what I want. Let's get some ice cream from the ice cream store. Let's see if it's any good. Uh, sure. Let's go check it out. It's right in the corner here. Oh, Bloxy, I can't wait for you to realize how delicious ice cream is. Oh, it's a cute store, but it's empty. Oh, don't worry, Titi. Oh. Goldie, don't just drop Bloxy for the ice cream. Come here. It says self-serve. No, Goldie. It says soft serve. You can just go in and serve yourself ice cream. But I'll leave some money since you already did it. It's really good, but I want to try the other flavor. They have so many different flavors. Okay, I'm going to leave some money here for your ice cream. And let's go to another store. Go to Claire's, 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 please. It's such a good store. All my friends go there and buy cute things for their room and like cute stuff and jewelry. Okay. Oh, they also have a Christmas store. I don't think there's anyone working there. I'm going to put baby Bloxy in the stroller. Hi. Hello, lady. Excuse me, lady. Do you guys still do that thing where you stick a sharp thing in the ear and the person goes, ah. And then they have a pretty Ed. earring. Yes, we do. Ed. Goldie, are you sure about ear piercing? Please, Titi, please. I want to get my ears pierced so bad more than anything in the world. All the girls at school have them, please. Please. I will never ask you for anything else. I am such a big sister, a good sister. I'm a good kid. Please, Mama, please. It can be really painful, Goldie. Are you sure? I am so sure about it. I've never been more sure in my whole entire life. Please. Come on, Titi. Well, how about we look around? Okay, she says that it's free ear piercing. But it's going to hurt, Gold. Are you sure you can handle that? It only hurts a little bit. You see, she said it only hurts a little bit. And she's a professional. And she said it's totally worth it. Well, how about we take a little look around the store first. And then we'll make a decision, okay? Oh, wow, they have so many knickknacks. That's what Grandma say about little stuff like this, like nail polish and like bracelets. Oh, little Bloxy wants to shop too. Do you want to get your ears pierced? You don't have to be scared. It's not going to hurt. And then you're going to get to have pretty earrings on. I think little Bloxy is a little too young for earrings. Oh, look, Goldie, they have all these cute phone cases. Oh, wait, you don't have a phone. Sorry. Oh, my goodness, Bloxy, where do you think you're going? You can go by yourself, silly. Look, Titi, I found a cute little toy for Bloxy. We can get her this cute unicorn. Aw, oh, that would be so cute. I think she likes it. Oh, look, they have LOL dolls. They have candles and play makeup. <laughs> oh, Bloxy just wants to be part of the adventure and touch everything. Careful, Bloxy. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. <coughs> Put on that perfume. <coughs> Come here. <coughs> Bloxy, no. It's not for you, silly. Look, Bloxy, I show you. Look at Big Sister. This perfume smells like cotton candy, unicorns, watermelon, and cinnamon. Ooh, that's fancy. Okay, I'm ready to get my ears pierced now. Let's get to business. But, Goldie, you didn't even look in the store. They have cute pencil cases. They have candles. They have, like, Jojo Siwa stuff. They have LOL dolls. They have 
best friend necklaces and jewelry. Look how cute. They have scrunchies. No, but I really want earrings. Oh, I found the perfect ones. These right here. They're little cherries. I want these ones, please, lady. Can you get these for me? Guys, if you buy three, you get three free. Of course. That's how Claire's gets you. You go there and they tell you that you buy three. And you get three free. And then you end up buying like so many unnecessary things. That's a good deal. Do you have little soccer ball earrings? Do you have little soccer balls? Okay, well, you can choose some earrings if they are three free. This is the best day ever. I am such a grown-up. I want this one and I want the little stars and the heart. Can you get them for me, please? I'm just so excited. I can't stop jumping. I'm so excited. This is the best day ever. Careful, Goldie. You stepped on the lady. Oh, I'm so sorry. I just can't help it. I'm too excited. <laughs> sorry. Okay, Goldie, so sit there to get your ears pierced. She said you can even hold on to the little bear. Aww. I'm not even scared, so I don't even need the bear. Okay, you just have to be a good listener, okay, Goldie? It should be pretty quick. Okay. Okay, so please sit down and show... I can get started. Okay, so just sit down, Goldie. Oh, Bloxy, what is she doing with that hair dryer? What are you doing? Why is there a hair dryer here? Okay, so she said, I'm going to start. It's going to be real quick. Okay, let's just do it already, please. I'm getting nervous now. Oh, Bloxy's crying. It's okay, Bloxy. Oh, Bloxy's scared for me. Don't worry, Bloxy. I'm not scared. I'm a big girl. I'm not scared of ear piercings. Okay, she's doing it. Ow! Holy unicorn, this is painful. Oh, leave me alone. Oh, it hurts so bad. Oh, my ear's gonna fall off. You said it would only hurt a little bit. This is really painful. I can't handle it. <laughs> Ow! Goldie, we told you it was gonna hurt. No, she said a little bit, and this hurt a lot. Well, Goldie, what are you going to do? You can't walk around with just one earring on. I'm not doing it. Aw, little Bloxy's mm -hmm. trying to make you feel better. Okay, we'll figure it out. The lady said you're still going to have to pay for that, even if you don't want it. I understand. Let me just talk to Goldie. I'm sure we can, you know, figure it out. I would like to know what kind of refund policy they have, Titi. This is, this is crazy madness. Actually, my ear now looks like a donut. I want them to put the hole back. I want the munchkin to be back in the hole now. I don't think they can do that, Goldie. Is she serious? Of course we can't put the hole back. Goldie, I understand you're a little scared and frustrated. We don't have to do the other ear. We can just leave it like that and come back at another time when you feel better. But you really wanted it. I'm sure it's going to be so quick and then it will, it will be worth it. I don't know, Titi. I don't know if I can trust that lady anymore. I'm sorry about this drama. My daughter is just a little overwhelmed. Okay, well, tell me what you want to do. Okay. Goldie, you can't hide in there, sweetie. We really have to make a decision. I want them to put the hole back in my ear. I want to speak to the manager of the store. She is Karen, and she is the manager of the store, Goldie. And it's really not the lady's fault, Goldie. We told you it would hurt. It's an ear piercing. It's okay, sweetie. Look how nice she's trying to be, Goldie. Mm. Listen, I've done this a hundred times. Mm -mm. The little girls cry for a second and then they're okay. So happy. I promise you're going to love your earrings. I think so too. And little Bloxy wants you to do it. She thinks that you can do it. Come on, Goldie. You're brave. You can do it. Come on. I know you can do it. Go take a seat. I guess I'll try. I don't want to be the weird girl with just one earring on. Okay, Goldie. One, one two, two, three. three. Pierce his ear. Did she do it already? Come on, let's get it over with already. Goldie, she's all done. What? Wow, Goldie, your earrings look beautiful. <gasps> Go look in the mirror. Oh my goodness, I look amazing. I look so cute. Titi, can you believe it? It is the cutest earrings in the whole entire universe. I told you, Titi, I could do it. That I wasn't going to be scared. That I was brave and I was a big girl. Yeah, okay. But they look so cute on you. I'm so happy you went through with it. Well, Karen is really glad you like it. And I'm going to go pay for the earrings because you did get a couple so you can change them out. But you have to wait in the beginning. All right, so let's pay. Uh, Karen, I kind of have like friends on YouTube, so can you like not tell anyone that I was crying like a baby and I was hiding in the corner? Okay, good talk. 
Okay, Goldie, let's go. Thank you so much. Bye, Karen. Bye, Karen, lady. Thank you. Oh, Goldie, let's go to Bath and Body Works. I love this store. Me too. I want to get some candles for the house. And they have a sale. Aromatherapy for $5. All aromatherapy. They probably have their winter candles already. yet. Come on. Uh, Titi, do I look like a teenager now or something? Because I look really cute. Okay, Goldie is really feeling herself <laughs> with her new earrings. I'm going to pretend I'm a teenager. Come on, mother. Let's go shopping. Hey, that lady looks familiar. Hey, that's Karen from Claire's. Oh, she works here too. Okay, cool. Oh, they already have the holiday candles and lotions. <gasps> oh my gosh, I am all about a good holiday candle. Let us know down in the comments if you guys like shopping at Bed Bath & Beyond, what your favorite candle is or what your favorite lotion is. I love sweet peas, like one of the originals, like the pink one. Goldie, don't turn on the candle. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, be careful, Bloxy. Oh, all my favorite candles are here. TT, I need to find up some, some grown-up lotions and stuff now that I'm practically a teenager with my new earrings. Okay. Um, Bloxy, be careful, sweetie. Let's let's put you back in your stroller. Ooh, but first I want to try the new soaps. I love like the gingerbread and like the winter uh, snowflake soaps they have. Oh, that smells real good, Titi. I want to try too. Come on, Bloxy. Do you need help finding anything, Goldie? Uh, yeah, actually. Um, um, I would like to know when the, where the teenager section is, please. It looks like everything here is for all ages, Goldie. Okay, so I'm gonna go buy my favorite lotion. Oh, look, Titi, they have a new face mask collection. Maybe we can have a mommy and daughter spa day. The, the three of us. That would be so cute. Let us know down in the comments if you guys want us to do a mommy and daughter spa holiday party or something. Yay! Well, I think I told her I want to go pay so we can go to other stores. Okay. So I'm getting all these holiday candles and holiday soaps for the house. Oh, just putting on a little perfume. It will be $65. Whoa. Thank you. Come on, Goldie. I really want to check out the holiday store before they close. Now that it's officially... After Halloween, it is time to start decorating and thinking about the holidays. Our favorite time of the year. Yay! Present Santa! Cool! This is so cute. It's called, um, what is it called? White Christmas? We can put the Santa's letter there. Oh, they have so many little Christmas decorations. I really wonder what they're going to give us this year in Bloxburg. I want to sit here in the, in the Santa sleigh. That is cute. They have a bunch of decorations and movies for the holidays. Oh, I love it. Oh, and they're going to have here like pictures with Santa. We definitely have to come take holiday pictures this year. All in matching outfits like pajamas or something. Well, you guys, we hope you enjoyed today's video. Let us know down in the comments if you have your ears pierced. Let us know all that stuff we asked before, but I can't remember. Make sure you are subscribed and you have the notification bell on because we're going to be posting yeah, lots and lots yeah. of videos. We have really good ones coming up. Yeah, we do. Thanks for watching. Bye. Say bye, Roxy. <laughs> Adios. Good morning, Goldie. It's time to wake up. It's time to go to school. Goldie. Oh, Bloxy, don't jump on her. <laughs> So adorable! You are talking like with your little baby talk. Oh, she loves me. Mommy, can I please get her dress for the day? Can I be a big sister helper? Yeah, I'll start making breakfast. That sounds like a great idea. Teamwork makes the dream work. Come on, Bloxy, let's change your diaper. I hope you don't have a really yucky one. Sorry if I banged your head by on the door. Let's see. Ooh, did you drink a gallon of milk yesterday? Ooh. All right, you're all clean. Then go ahead, and I need to go wash my hands. So let me put you down for a second. All righty, we're all finished. Hey, guys, do you like my new pajamas? Let's put Bloxy on her chair. Goldie, I made you a fruit salad this morning. I know you really like that. 
Yay, my favorite! Ooh, my big sister duties. I need to empty out the dishwasher and put all the plates away. Oh, oh boy. Oh, brother, they're heavy. Be careful, Goldie. Do you need help? No, I'm a big sister. I can do it. Back up, please. I can do it on my own. Let's see. Oh, there's no space there. Let's see. We still have some quarantine snacks over. And then I just placed them here. All right, let's go eat. Oh, this soup is the soup that Kochi made. The stew. <laughs> we we need to put it away. It's not good anymore. Oh, Kochi's such a good chef. That was really good food. Oh, breakfast time. Hey, little Bloxy took my fruit salad. And she's eating it. That's okay. That's what big sisters do. They just, they just don't even fight with the baby. So I'm just going to make myself a bowl of cereal. Thank you, Goldie, but Bloxy really liked it. Yep, she did. Mm, I like cereal, too. Uh, let me put my dish in the dishwasher because we're being super helpful now. All right, Goldie, you should probably go get dressed, okay? I don't want you to be late for school. Oh, Bloxy stole an ice cream. Where did you even learn that from? Did you like it? No? What in the world? Bloxy's just acting a little, a little naughty today. Oh, wait, you're going to fall off the table. What are you doing, little sister? Big sister's here to help. I'm going to put on the cute little unicorn show that kind of hypnotizes you so you can let Mommy do stuff this morning. And Mommy probably needs to get some stuff done. She also likes the cooking channel, but this unicorn is a little more friendly for her. There you go. You're a good baby. Here's your pacifier. Oh, I am such a big sister helper, right, baby Loxy? <laughs> I think that means yes. Well, I need to get dressed for school. I'm going to wear my favorite outfit. My little strawberry number. Not this one. Oh, brother. There we go. Cute. No, I'm not going to put the pom-poms on my head. That's too much like Bloxy. I need to be my own person. Don't tell my mommy, but I'm going to put on a little, a little blush. Just a little bit. Like the TikTok girls. Guys, I really want to... Redo my bedroom. I've had this for like four years. Give it a big thumbs up if you want to see how I do my room. But before I go to school, I need to continue doing big sister chores. And that is putting my laundry in the, in the dirty, well, in the laundry room. That's a lot of laundry words. Because my mommy has a lot of things to do. So I am a big girl and I do my own stuff. Plus, if I don't, I won't get an allowance. Now I'm just gonna borrow TT straightener, you know, to make sure my hair is on point and I'm looking good. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Brush my tears. And oh, we still have all that toilet paper from quarantine. We didn't even use it. Okie dokie. I think I'm almost ready to go. Mm-hmm. I'm looking cute, feeling confident, ready to take on this day. That's right. Mm-hmm. Strike a pose. Hi, little Boxy baby sister. Have a good day doing absolutely nothing because you're a baby and your life is easy. Oh, brother. She really loves the unicorn show. It's like she's hypnotized. Oh, well. Have a nice day, baby sister. Bye, Goldie. Have a good day. Thanks for helping out so much this morning. You're welcome. Bye, Titi. I'm here at school, but where's my bestie, Sarah? She told me she was already here. Sarah, uh, why are you wearing pajamas to school? I don't understand. They're cute though, the pandas and stuff. My mom didn't wake me up on time. Oh, I'm sorry. Been there before. Sarah, there's that boy that always wants to talk to you. Oh my gosh, he's got a lot of jewelry on, Sarah. I don't think Sarah really likes him. He's too much of a show off. Yeah, I'm sorry dude, I'm not that into you. <gasps> Sarah tells it like it is, she doesn't hold back. Alright, well let's get all our stuff from our locker because we're gonna have class. Got my notebook. So girl, yeah, what's going on? Wait, are you cool popular girls? Are you talking about me and Sarah? Oh no, we're just regular girls, but thank you. No popular girls here. Oh yeah, Sarah, um, being a big sister is going really well for me, actually. Let's take a seat. I really enjoy being with baby Bloxy. She's a good sister. Did you do the homework? Yeah, of course. Can I copy? <gasps> Please? Sarah? Whoa, that girl just made an explosion. Easy. 
Well, well, Sarah, I don't know, Sarah, I don't think so, so how will you learn for next time if I give you my homework? Hmm, you tell me, how are you going to do it next time? I don't know, I will just copy you. <gasps> okay, fine, but I'm going to copy you next time. Hey guys, if you want to see like a full day of me in school with my friends and stuff, give this video a big thumbs up because I'm only going to show you like a little bit because this is not really a school day. It's more of like a big sister vibe, you know? So, that's it. Sarah, look! There's Hannah. She's one of the most popular girls in school. She's like a TikTok star. She's got a whole 4,000 followers. And I even think Charlie D'Amelio reposted one of her dances. Hi, girl, looking fresh today. Aw, she's always ignoring us. Popular girl ignores us. Hmm. Oh, my goodness, she said what? No. Oh, Sarah, she just dissed you. Um, it's okay, Sarah, don't be sad. She's just too popular for us, but it's okay. We don't need to fit in. Alright, well, it's time for me to go home. Um, actually, today I have a soccer practice with Kochi, so I need to get going. Well, I'm here in the park to do... Wait, where is everyone? There's no Kochi, there's no Melody, there's no Madison, there's no Adley, then no one's here for practice today. What's going on? Maybe Kochi doesn't want to be my coach after he had a date with Titi, and nothing really came out of it. No... I don't know, I guess I'll just go home. Maybe they all got sick or something. I hope not, that would be pretty terrible. Alright, well let's just go home, I guess. It's a nice sunny day. Maybe Titi will let us go swimming after I do my schoolwork. Hello everyone, I'm home. Shh, Goldie. Maybe Bloxy's still taking a nap. Oh, sorry. It's okay, she should be waking up soon. Oh, wait, why are you wearing a soccer uniform? To play soccer? Why? What else? But you don't have soccer practice today. Soccer practice was on Tuesday. Oh my goodness, that explained why there was nobody there! Oh, I'm so silly. <laughs> oh, Goldie, you are so confused sometimes. I'm gonna go wake up baby Bloxy, okay? Yeah, she should be waking up from her nap. I'm gonna wash my hands first, because I don't want any germs on baby sister. Baby sister, Goldie's here. Oh, she's so sweet. Come here, little Bloxy bear. Hey, I need to do some schoolwork, so why don't you sit here in the playroom and play with your toys while I do my schoolwork? That way, we're kind of hanging out, but also I'm doing what I need to do. I need to write a paper about why a panda should not live in the jungle. Well, it's an opinion paragraph. I think pandas should not live in the jungle because they eat bamboo and there's no bamboo in the jungle. I think. Also, the weather is too hot in the jungle and pandas need cold temperature, I think. Oh, I don't know what I'm writing. I really don't like writing essays. They really confuse me. Okay, also, there's tigers in the jungle and then tigers eat pandas, I think. Okay, done. This is the first time Baby Blocks is going to the pool. She wants to sunbathe for a little bit. Oh, that's adorable. Look, Goldie, I'm going to show you my brand new skills I've been practicing on the little trampoline. Okay, let's see it, Titi. Ready? Whoa, Titi, how did you learn how to do these really cool flips? I want to try, I want to try. Excuse me. Uh, it's not working for me. Jump higher. <gasps> I did it. Well, I'm an Olympian, Goldie. Woo wow, this is so cool. I should have a pool party and invite all the kids from school before... It's winter and it starts to snow everywhere. That is so awesome. Maybe Bloxy doesn't know how to swim yet. So, oops, oops, sorry, Bloxy. I'll try to keep your head over the water. Oops, sorry. Let's put her in the floaty. Come on, Bloxy. You can relax in the floaty. Oh, look. We're swimming together, Mama. That is so sweet. Here, let's spin Bloxy around in her little, in her little floaty. Oh, she likes it. It's spinning around. There's nothing like a nice afternoon swim to relax after a long day of being a big sister. Oh, Mommy, I think she's getting a little dizzy. No, she likes it. I'm going to stay with Bloxy. Maybe this weekend I'm going to try to show Bloxy how to swim so she can be having one much more fun in the pool. Okay, Goldie, it's time to go inside and eat dinner, so... 
Get ready and I'll meet you for dinner. Goldie, your Halloween candy is so delicious. I've been eating it like all day today. Hey, that's my favorite one. TT, don't eat all of my candy. Okay, I warmed up some mac and cheese for Bloxy, and now I'm eating some leftovers Grandma left us. Big girl, your meatballs. Mmm, so good. Well, guys, hope you enjoyed my day as a big sister. And, Titi, what are you doing? I'm just doing some yoga. Awkward. Um, like and subscribe for more videos. Bye. I'm trying to get dinner ready because Goldie should be home from school in just a couple of minutes. And I'm really hoping she had a good time. I'm going to make her favorite some pasta. She loves pasta lately. And I found a new recipe. Oh, that must be her. She probably forgot her keys again. Hi. How was school today, Goldie? How was your day? Did you tell your friends you have a new bedroom? Did you invite them over for a sleepover this weekend? It was another great day at school. Not, I still have no friends and nobody cared about my new room. Not even the guy that like always asked me to give him my dessert at lunch. He didn't even care about it. And quite honestly, I don't even want to talk about it. I just want to play with my little sister. Oh, wait, Goldie. She's actually taking a nap right now, so we can't wake her up, but she'll be really cranky. But I was going to make you your favorite pasta for dinner. I'm not even hungry, thanks, Titi. Oh, there is nothing worse for a parent than to see your kid suffering, especially at school. And with friends, kids can be really cruel, you know? Let's go check up on Goldie. I feel so bad. Like, what can I even do to help her? Goldie, are you alright? I'm so sorry you're having a hard time at school. It's not even that it's a hard time. It's just lonely. You know, I used to be the, the life of the party. The, the light of the light show. The sprinkled on the cupcake. And now I don't have anyone to really be friends with or talk to. And no one really wants to talk to me. And my only bestie Sarah is like, want to talk about boys and dating. And I don't know what else to do. I just feel like I don't belong. I completely understand you. I know it's hard when friends, you know, grow apart and you feel lonely in a new place. <sighs> hey, I have an idea. What if we do something fun, something different? Why don't we give you like a little makeover? Play around with a new hairstyle, maybe get you a new outfit. You know, I you've always wanted to kind of change things up a little bit. Are you serious, Titi? I think that's a really great idea. Sometimes it's kind of fun to like do a different hairstyle or just try a different like vibe in your outfit. I'm so glad you think it's a good idea. We can drop off Baby Bloxy with Grandma and then we can go to the hair salon and pick out a new outfit. But, but Titi, you said that Grandma wasn't like a good influence or role model for Baby Bloxy for her development and for her well-being. Grandma can be a little crazy, but she loves you guys very much. And we can make an exception for this time. So we're here. Wow, this place is fancy shamancy. Look at her pretty hair. I know, she probably just came out of the salon. She's so pretty. She's a fan. Oh, my friend, I have a friend. Oh, hi, thank you. You are so pretty. Your hair is gorgeous. I can't tell her her hair is pretty and blocking it. Okay, I told her in like a different way. <laughs> okay, Goldie, so let's go inside and we'll work some magic and get you some hairstyles. Okay, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Okay, I'm real nervous. Oh, this is pretty, but it looks so much like Sarah's. I like the hat, but no, I'm not a French girl. No, can't see anything. I'll trip and fall. Okay, okay, well, how about this one? No, not really. How about we go for a massage? This is kind of stressing me out. Well, they have like a bunch of other things to do at the spa. They have like a massage, like the mud bath. Do you want to try those things before we continue? Sure. How is your massage? Okay, Titi, listen up. I don't know about your skills as a stylist and I don't know if you haven't noticed, but I have no hair! Titi, I can't go to school like this with no hair. You gotta do something about it. You gotta fix it. I will fix it. Don't worry. Relax. How about you come over here and I'll wash your scalp a little bit and then we'll, we'll figure it out a hairstyle. I want hair like that, girl. It's so pretty. Okay, well, if you want me to fix your hair, you gotta get out of the mud bath. Fine. 
Don't worry, Goldie. I promise we will find the perfect hairstyle for you. Do you trust me? I trusted you, and now I have no hair. Come on, take a seat. I'll figure something out. You see, you were so worried. I told you I would fix your hair. I love my new hair. It's so pretty. It's like mermaid waves, I think it's called. And I feel, I feel like a, I just feel so confident. I love that you love your hair, Goldie. I mean, it's just a little different hairstyle. You can always go back to your pigtails whenever you want. I know. I'm feeling really special and fashionable. Mm -hmm. You can take my picture if you want. <laughs> You can take a couple of pictures so I can send Granny and Boxy. Granny's gonna love my new look. <laughs> hey, but we're not done yet. We still have to choose a outfit. And I have something perfect in my closet I think you're going to love. I can wear some of your clothes? Yes, come on. I have a really cute outfit that I think you are going to love as soon as you wear it. Let me see. I hope it's pink. I know you know I really like pink. Okay, go try it on. Are you ready? Almost. All right, let's see it. Oh, I love it. Do you like it? It's so pretty. It's still me, but a little bit different. I think it looks great. Look at me. I'm feeling pretty fabulous. Look at my hair bouncing around. I look like practically a teenager. I look like practically a TikTok star or something. Well, you look like yourself, just in a different way. I love it. I love it. I can't wait to go to school and show my friends my brand new look. Hey guys, if you like Goldie's new look, make sure to hit that like button or tell us down in the comments. I can't wait to go to school and show everyone my new look tomorrow. Hi! Hi there! Oh my goodness, everybody likes my new look! Hi! Yeah, I'm Goldie, hi! I can't believe this! People really like my new look and I'm making so many new friends! I, I can't believe it! Do you like my new look too? They actually really like it and people are wanting to be my friend! Somebody asked me to sit at lunch with them today! This is amazing! Oh my goodness, oh, I think there's Sarah! There's Sarah over there. Oh, hi, Sarah. Hi, where's Goldie? What is everyone doing here? Um, duh, Sarah, it's me, Goldie. Who else did you think it was? Hi, where is she? Does she not recognize me, silly head? It's me, Goldie, hello. I just got a new look. What? Oh, I think, who are you? Come on, Sarah, it's me. Don't you like my new style? All my new friends do. Who are all these people? Oh, these are my new friends. That's what that's who they are. I made a bunch of new friends. That friend just said she looks so nice with her new look. People are really liking my new style. Oh, gotta go to class. Even though I look fabulous, don't want to be late. It's lunchtime, my favorite part of the day. Am I right? I'm so hungry. And I'm gonna sit with some of my new friends today at lunch. I don't have to sit all by myself anymore. Mmm, my favorite. Looks like this day is just getting better and better. Hi guys, wanna sit down over here and eat lunch together? Cool. Oh, hi Sarah. This is so yummy. It's so nice to have friends to sit with. Oh, Sarah asked me if she can sit. Um, well, Sarah, uh, why don't you go sit with... How about you go sit with your new friend, Sarah? Remember them? The ones that you were hanging out with and I had to sit up on myself. Plus, I think this table is going to get full pretty quickly. But I wanted to sit with you, she said. Well, uh, maybe tomorrow, Sarah. Uh, I'm kind of busy with my new friends right now. Yeah, I'm sorry, Sarah, but I'm kind of busy with my new best friend at the moment. But we'll talk later. Bye, see ya! Yeah, this is so good. You can try the chicken nuggets. I had such a great day. I can't wait to tell TT. I'm home. Hey, Goldie. How was your day? Tell me everything. Did your friends like your new look? Did Sarah like it? Tell me everything. Yeah, everyone liked it. They were like, whoa, Goldie, I like your hair. I like your style. You look so nice. And I couldn't believe it. I made so many new friends. And it was a really good day. It was a good idea, Titi. Thanks. 
I'm so happy. And I sat with like five different new friends at lunch. It was really fun. So did you get to know all your new friends? Did you tell them about your favorite hobbies? What you like to do for fun? What your favorite books are? No, not really. Nobody really asked me about about anything like that about me. They just told me they liked my hair and my outfit. And they asked me where I could get the same outfit. It was really fun. Hmm. Uh, but what about Sarah? Did she like your new look? Well, Sarah tried to kind of talk to me, but I was a little busy talking to all my new friends. And now that I think about it, maybe I was a little rude. She tried to stay with me at lunchtime, and I told her that I was busy with my new best friends to go stay with her friends, the ones she ignored me for. Goldie, that's not nice. You know how that made you feel. That made you feel really sad. And now you're doing it to Sarah? Look, friends can argue and, and fight sometimes, disagree, but Sarah was your best friend. She knew you from the start. That's not the right way to treat a friend. Oh, you're right, Titi. I feel really bad about it now. That's not who I am. That's not my personality. I think you owe her an apology, Goldie. Look, I think you should pick up the phone and call Sarah right now. Tell her you're sorry. I'm sure she feels pretty bad about this too. Yes, Titi, but before I call her, I want to do something really quick. I've been really thinking about this and this new look is nice and all, but it's, it's changing who I am. And that's not who Goldie is. Much better. I realize that no matter what you look like on the outside, if people don't like you for who you really are, then all that doesn't even matter. I want people to like me for me, not because I have a fancy outfit and fancy hair. I want people to like me for being myself. And I think you're perfect just the way you are. Sarah, do you want to come over? We need to talk. Goldie, you're a really good friend. I am so proud of you. I'm going to put Bloxy to sleep. Okay. Good luck with Sarah. I'm a little nervous. Maybe some ice cream to calm my nerves. Yeah, that's a little better. Mm. Oh, that must be Sarah. Okay, let's open the door and just, just be yourself. She's your best friend. Sarah, hi. Um, hi, Sarah. Um, well, hi, Gold. Uh, come in, please, come in. Um, I don't want, I'm a little nervous. So I kind of feel bad. What do you mean? I feel bad too. Uh, would you like some ice cream? I'm sorry, Sarah, that I acted that way today. And I told you to go sit with your new friends during lunchtime and I ignored you. And quite frankly, I was pretty mean to you, Sarah. I, I don't want to be mean to you. You're my best friend. But you kind of did hurt my feelings on the first day of school. You were sorry you feel bad about the first day too. Well, I guess we all made mistakes. These people are not even fun like you. Oh, stop it, Sarah. We're besties. Don't ever forget that. Sometimes we go through little bumps. I miss us being best friends. Well, me too. Like the good old days in the playground. Right when Titi forgets to pick me up from soccer. <laughs> I love you, Sarah. We're best friends forever. Sarah, you don't really like me for me because you didn't even notice I changed my look back. Yeah, you look better this way, much comfier. Mm-hmm. Best friends forever. Let's do our best friend stand. Oh yeah, and post. And post. Should I go post? For the gram? For the TikTok? Oh yeah. <laughs> that is funny. I'm so glad we talked it out, Sarah. Oh yeah. Do you wanna go see my new room? I deck well, Titi decorated my whole new bedroom. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Like the good old days, I agree. Titi said we can have a sleepover too. But let me show you my room. I think you're gonna love it. It is really cool. And a little more grown. Come on. Do you like my room? Yay. Do I want to play Among Us? I've never done it before. But I see everybody's doing it. Let's play. Can you help me? All I know is we need to find imposters. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and don't forget, sometimes our friends can hurt our feelings and make mistakes, but we're all humans. It's important to talk about our feelings and talk things out, and it's always good to forgive. Thanks for watching! Okay, Sarah, this game is crazy.